What's up, everybody? This is Tim. We've got a personal box. This is my last one. It's been on the shelf for probably a couple weeks now. Greatest Hits of Basketball 2016. This is a Leaf product for Anthony C. Good luck, buddy. We are filling up Anthology 69. We've got those teams remaining right there. All right. Let's see what I can do for you on Greatest Hits. Oh my god, it's not Rodman on the top. What the hell's going on in the world? It's not Rodman. It's the first time I've ever had one of these without a Rodman on them. Alright, there's your empty box. There's my packing materials. Sweet. No Rodman. Instead of Rodman, you got Craig Hodges. Greatest hits. Let me lower the uh, camera here and get the zoom on. There we go. Craig Hodges. I don't know if you'd rather have Hodges or Rodman, dude. They're just about in every box. He was a pure shooter. Three dollars. Three dollars. Nineteen consecutive threes. Nice. Oh wait, that's the All-Stars Skills Competition. Look at the bright side. All right, here you go. You got one, two, three, four cards and a slab underneath. Oh boy. All right. Jason Kidd, 10 of 10 from Flores. Flores. I need to zoom that out a little bit. That's better. All right, Jay Kidd in a Nets uniform on card auto, of course. Encased by Panini. Or encased by Leaf? What the hell? Guess they got rid of the Panini uh, seal and slapped the Leaf one on there. 10 out of 10. Jason Kidd. Or maybe that wasn't one of the slapped ones. Your second auto is a KD out of 25 from Immaculate. Two pretty nice cards. Red parallel Kevin Durant on card for the Thunder. J Kid, 10 out of 10 to start. Okay. Dude. What the hell? This is badass. Old school Shaquille O'Neal autograph with a jersey. Old school Bowman. Authentic game worn with ink. That card has all sorts of frickin' teams on it. <laughs> Listed as Heat, pictured in a Magic with a Lakers game worn jersey. That's awesome. Whatever. I think that's awesome. Bowman flashback. I have no idea what year this is, do you? Let's check it out. Oh, nice, dude. That's numbered out of 60. 45 out of 60 on the Shack. That's gotta be a pretty damn rare card, obviously. Uh, 2004 Bowman. Man. Heat as the team. Magic jersey pictured. Lakers game worn. I think that's badass. One of a kind. If it was a scrubby player, then yeah, I'd bash the hell out of it. That's something else. Definitely a muck card, Chad. They couldn't fit uh, the Phoenix Suns in there or anywhere, or the Cavs. <laughs> I guess he hadn't played for them back in 2004, though. Imagine this card coming out of a break. What the hell? What team do you give this to? Random it off? Anyways, 45 out of 60, man. It's only missing the Suns and the Cavs. And I don't know if this is a big one, but you asked for MJ... It's a graded 8 by Beckett, and it's a 87-88 Jordan, number 59. That's the best full angle view I can get you of it. 87-88, number 59 Jordan, graded 8. I mean, by our rules, it would go to the Heat, because it says Heat on card, yeah. It also has the Heat logo on the back. 
That's freaking hilarious. Three teams in the shack. That's a pretty good box, right, Anthony? Assuming the Jordan's a hundred or two hundred, maybe three hundred. You gotta figure the KD's around a hundred. The kid's probably fifty to sixty. I don't know what that Shaq's worth. I have no freaking clue. Two hundred for the Shaq, maybe. One fifty, two fifty. I have no idea. There you go. Two fifty for the Jordan. So I gotta think at least two hundred for the Shaq, right? It does have a streaky auto on the shack. That's the only complaint I would say. It's got a streaky S. Not too shabby then. Unless that shack's somehow under a hundred bucks, which I can't possibly imagine. But again, I don't know basketball that well, so I could be wrong. Stevie says it's the best box he's ever seen. That's pretty solid. Something was sticky there. The hell was sticky. Top of the leaf sticker. Oh, it's the original top sticker still. Not a leaf sticker. Nice. There you go. You don't like that Shaq's 200 numbered out of 60, Chad? Yeah, Danny, a nasty Hall of Fame relic. Uh, Garrick, DiMaggio, and Clemente out of 18. It was a pretty damn good break. It wasn't spread out too well, though. It was mostly Yankees. Yep, Babe Ruth 101.